you're working or boating or lounging, I have the perfect summertime cluster wardrobe for you. These are clusters for your actual summer. Stay tuned. Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Netta and my whole goal for this channel is to help you build a wardrobe and a style that you love. So you look beautiful, you feel confident every single day. So this week we are talking about clusters. Clusters is a concept that I've kind of pieced together from different things that I've heard and learned over the years as a personal stylist. And it really involves taking six to seven items, six items typically, and using those items to build a wardrobe. So they can be the building block of a wardrobe for a season, for a reason, for um, a specific lifestyle area, and, and really a tool to help you be more intentional about your shopping and about your wardrobe building. So on in Tuesday's video, I talked about clusters. I talked all about how they can be used as building blocks for the wardrobe and the nine benefits and nine pluses of using a cluster to build your own wardrobe. Today I want to talk about clusters that I created for different areas of what may be your actual life or lifestyle. These are clusters that were requested by women in the VIP group that I've heard feedback like, oh, it'd be really cool to see this kind of cluster. It'd be really cool to see this kind of cluster. So I've, I've covered a wide range of brands, of price points, and of lifestyles in these clusters. So I can't wait to share some of my clusters so you can see Okay, so how would I do that with pieces that I have in my own wardrobe? How would I do that for this area of my life where I feel like I'm constantly unprepared or underdressed for? Like maybe you feel like you just don't have any church dresses or maybe you feel like you only have dressy things and if, it, you know, if, if you're going to do something fun on the weekends, you don't have anything for that. A cluster can be a way to address or to fill in any gaps in your wardrobe in a really systematic and focused way so that you get the most bang for your buck. You can buy fewer items and get more impact in your wardrobe. Okay, so let's get started. The first cluster I want to talk about is a travel cluster. Now, this is for adventure travelers only. I am going to Europe and taking flowy dresses and espadrilles, but if you're an adventure traveler, a frequent traveler who needs performance fabrics, who likes to do things like hike and bike and, and whatever, uh, canyon or canoe, I don't know, any of those types of things. If you want performance fabrics, keep in mind performance fabrics are available everywhere from Lululemon and Athleta to Walmart. Like you can buy performance fabrics anywhere. You do not have to buy a travel specific brand. That said, it can be fun to pick up some travel specific pieces, especially as a frequent traveler. And if you're going to do that, Anatomy is my go-to for it. It's Anatomy with an IE, just a great brand for travel specific pieces. So I created a cluster from Anatomy that includes um, two bottoms. The bottoms are their Skylar travel pant. It's a very popular, famous travel pant of theirs, kind of like a stretch pull-on style pant. And their um, Kalen shorts. This is a tailored short that gives a little bit of a, a dressier look for a short and it comes in beige and black. So those are the two bottoms for the cluster, the Skylar travel pants and the Kalen shorts. For the dress, I picked the Hattie dress. It's a really comfy, easy knit dress. It comes in a couple of different colors, but it's a great pull on style dress if you want to go out to dinner or if you're doing something that involves wearing a dress. Um, okay, for the tops for this cluster, because you know, just really quickly, if, if you need a recap, clusters are three tops, two bottoms, and a jacket, um, as well as I've been adding in dresses for summer. So we have the Hattie dress, we have the two bottoms, the shorts, and the pants. Now we're going to look at the three tops. The three tops that we have are the Maria long sleeve top. I chose this one in red because I thought it would be a fun pop of color for this cluster. It's just a long sleeve knit top. Um, the Melissa short sleeve tee, so a tee like a basically a long sleeve tee and a short sleeve tee and then this flow pima cotton tank that's got this breathable mesh um all of their fabrics are very very high quality and very very much designed for performance wear they they're breathable they do all the things so you've got a tank a tee and a long sleeve top right essentially a, uh, a pair of pants and a pair of shorts and a dress now 
Um, anatomy doesn't have any accessories, but to this cluster, I would add, if you're doing any act, act, active things or athletic things, you need a pair of athletic shoes as well as, in my opinion, a really pretty pair of sandals um, that you can dress up or down to wear to dinner. Those are going to be the, the, the absolute requirements of shoes, and you're going to need some kind of um, hat to protect yourself from the sun if you're going to be doing sporty activities. So that is kind of an adventure travel cluster wardrobe for those of you who are going on those adventurous hikes and bikes and trips like that this summer. Okay, now let's move on to a different category. What if you are, oh, I forgot the jacket. Sorry, I forgot the jacket. This is the Travel City Slick Jacket from Anatomy. Every cluster has to have a jacket or some sort of completer piece. I think this is a great one because it can be dressed up or down a little bit. It's a very, very practical and versatile jacket, and it's a little bit more polished than some of the more rugged style jackets that are generally available on travel sites. So this is my favorite of their jackets. Okay, now we're gonna move on to uh, a business casual cluster. I feel like when I created this cluster, I pictured it as something that would work for a teacher who maybe is an early elementary teacher, anyone who works with kids, if you volunteer, if you um, volunteer in your church preschool, if you, like I said, if you teach younger kids, if you're up and down and on the floor a lot and you need clothes that are practical, but you also want them to be really cute. So I created a cluster from loft using all loft items for that lifestyle. So business casual, a little bit more on the casual, casual side but really really cute practical versatile cluster okay so it starts with this um pair i love these pants i'm obsessed with them the wide leg sailor pants i think i'm going to get these from loft the wide leg sailor pants because they you know loft comes in petite sizes and so hard to find a sailor pant petite i love these so these are in navy i thought these were fun and and really really cute but also like they're navy so they're not going to get that dirty you can get down on the floor you can do all the different things with them um the other pair of um bottoms is this paisley button down pull on midi skirt um so this is a flowy skirt again it'll be comfortable it'll be easy to get up and down I'm assuming you probably have basic jeans and shorts so i didn't include them in this but of course that could be part of the cluster as well but i chose two pieces that i didn't think most people have a pair of navy wide leg pants and then the pattern skirt so those are the two bottoms in this cluster now we're going to go on to the three tops so the the first top is the paisley ruched ruched strap cami that goes with the skirt together they look like a dress separately they work very very well with the other pieces so this cami is the first of the tops that i chose now the second top is this linen blend relaxed everyday shirt it's just an easy breezy linen shirt that's really comfortable it, it can get a little rumpled um, if you don't want to do uh white you can do a chambray color instead it will look equally chic with this cluster and then the last top is a lightweight striped cotton sweater. I felt like it went really well with everything here. It looks great with the navy pants. It looks great with the um, with the paisley skirt. You can do the stripe and the floral together. Like it's just a great third piece. And then you've got different weights, right? You've got different levels. So you've got the scrappy top. You've got the linen shirt that's also breezy. And then you've got a sweater that is still light but offers a little bit more warmth and coverage. So those are the, 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 the five basic pieces. Now for the dress slash um, jumpsuit combo or just dress slash jumpsuit, it can be either, but like a one and done type of piece. Um, I love this mock strappy jumpsuit. I think it's so practical and so comfortable and a great option if you don't want to dress, if you feel like a dress does not fit your lifestyle. And if you really are on the floor playing with kids, I feel like this is just a fabulous option. Now keep in mind that that linen camp shirt can be worn open as a layering piece or you can throw on a denim jacket which would be my completer piece of choice it can be any color that you want but a denim jacket would be a great addition to this cluster now of course i had to add accessories because loft does have cute accessories i added the straw tote you can take your work stuff in it and then go to the beach afterwards it's a really really good price and it's got that little bit of navy trim which i think makes it so so cute i added these really cute um lace-up sneakers with this pattern on the on the laces that I thought was adorable. It is currently sold out, but they said that they hope to restock that. So hopefully that'll come back in. I thought these were so cute and so practical and also went with everything in the
the cluster. And then the other pair of shoes is a pair of brown sandals. Also from Loft, these are the strappy leather ankle sandals. I think this is just a great classic sandal that will work really, really well with this cluster. And if it works for your lifestyle to do, or, or your, your workplace to do an open-toed shoe or a sandal like this, I think this is a great choice. Okay, so that is the Loft cluster for business casual, for teachers, for just a really kind of like running around kind of casual lifestyle. Okay, now let's look at a professional cluster. Of course, I had to turn to M.M. LaFleur for a professional cluster because I feel like they do it really better than anybody. They do such good, like, professional corporate but but really modern and also really wearable and washable and all the things i just feel like they check all the boxes so um we are going to start with the tops from mm lafleur this is their emmy top and eco soft wave it's just a cream sleeveless top very versatile very stylish um i also like the nora top in green the beautiful green color also in the eco soft wave fabric and then the Vicky Tank in Leopard. Um, it's a washable silk and it's machine washable, lightweight and blue sign approved. So it's eco-friendly, but love those three tops as the tops for this cluster. Again, it's always three tops, two bottoms and a jacket as well as a dress. So let's go to the dress. I chose this really comfortable Pima Cotton Renee dress. I thought this was the type of dress that could go really well in business casual days, but also be dressed up when you paired it with the blazer that's coming up. Now for the two bottoms, we have the Cobble Hill skirt and washable wool, wool twill. Um, I love this in camel because I think it really goes well with the tops that we've chosen. It also will go with the blazer. Um, so you've got, you're gonna have two different colored bottoms. So you've got a little bit more variety and versatility in that cluster wardrobe. Now for the pants, I chose the Colby pants in the origami tech. This is a fabulous fabric for travel. Um, I, have, I have a couple of clients that swear by this fabric for travel. It's a beautiful suiting material that doesn't wrinkle and is very, very practical. So the Colby pants in black and then the cobble hill skirt and camel those are the two bottoms the jacket is the moorland jacket also in that origami tech that's really travel friendly so you've got a suit look when you add the um the moorland jacket and the colby pant together with like the white blouse or the green blouse um and then you can also do a little bit mix it up a little bit more maybe do the leopard um, top with the camel skirt and the black blazer like you've just got lots and lots of different options here for shoes because they do such a good job with their accessories i really like this irene sling back in black suede i think it's very elegant it's very work appropriate. If you can do the sling back in your work setting, if you've got a little bit more of a relaxed work setting, I think that's so, so pretty and so modern. Um, I also like this Rowan flat in this metallic um, because that's going to go with everything. It's going to be very polished. It's going to be very, very elegant. And then for bags, I really like this Senrev Maestra bag that they have on their site. I think it's a great work bag. It's in a light neutral, um, very, very versatile. And you're going to have all your boxes checked for um, a cluster word wardrobe for a professional wardrobe. If you're going back to work, if you know a student who's going to work for the first time, they're graduating and they need a professional wardrobe, anybody who's who maybe you've transitioned to a, a dressier workplace, this is a great system to use. And it's a great site. To, now, it uh, M.M. LaFleur is a pricier site. You can do this with J. Crew. You can do this with Target. You can do this with any store that you shop at. But it just happens to be a favorite of mine and I wanted to show you their selection. Okay, what if you wanted a very casual, like I don't leave the house casual, but if I do leave the house, I wanna look okay type of wardrobe. Maybe you're hanging out with your grandkids all day, all day. Maybe you're cleaning or gardening or cooking or just lounging around the house, but you don't want clothes with holes in them that are rattered and tattered and torn and worn and your husband's old baggy t-shirts and your ugly leggings, you, you know, whatever. You don't want those. You want a step up from that, but you want it to be just as practical. So I created an at-home, super casual cluster wardrobe with items from Walmart. Now, um, I'm going to start with accessories because I think they're so important and really can add that little touch. And yes, sometimes you will wear accessories if you leave the house. So I, I added a baseball cap because I feel like if you're doing a really casual look and you've got the hair that can pull off a baseball cap, mine's a little more challenging, then it's just a cute way to like cover up your hair if you're not loving your hair that day or just to add a little touch of sportiness to an at-home casual outfit. So I just have to throw in the baseball cap idea. They have a solid black baseball cap for 11 
$11. I you can't beat that. They also have these sneakers. All of these pieces are from Time and True. They have these uh, women's platform sneakers. Um, these are really cool, simple, white fashion sneaker that is comfortable. It looks um, really stylish. And this is going to be a, a great um, practical shoe option that you can throw on with all of these super casual looks. So I definitely recommend if you're going to swap you know, swap up or you're going to upgrade that at-home outfit. You want to upgrade from the athletic sneaker to a fashion sneaker. Um, this is a slide. So saying that you, maybe you're wearing flip-flops at, you know, when you're when you're running errands. Instead, consider this time and true women's cutout mules. They're $18. These are so stylish and on trend, but they're super comfortable. I'm all about the slip on shoes these days. Like they just, they solve so many problems for me. I think they're just so perfect. Um, and I just feel like you can't beat them for, for comfort and also style. So those are my accessory options. Now let's talk about the clothes. We're gonna start with the ja jacket. They did not have a lot of lighter weight jackets in Time and True, but I did choose this denim jacket in a light wash. I feel like this is a great casual jacket. If you don't like the denim jacket, you can do a utility jacket. You can do a fleece like zip up hoodie jacket. You can do any type of, of, of lightweight outer layer, but this denim jacket works very well with this cluster. Now we're gonna to go to the three tops. We have three um, different styles here, so we have a little bit of versatility. The first is a long-sleeved ivory Henley top, a waffle weave Henley top. Super comfortable, super cozy, super easily. I actually have a long-sleeved Henley top from Walmart that I did in my Walmart haul last summer, and I love it. The quality is really nice, it feels really nice, and it's only $14. Um, I also picked a pretty, little bit more decorative T-shirt. This is still a T-shirt, it's still very casual, but it's an eyelet yoke. Um, top and I chose it in this pretty pink color so you've got a little bit of something extra and the outfits don't look you know so basic or so casual so I love that as a second option and then for the third top we have a striped classic black and white striped top so it's a t-shirt um, it's going to be very casual it's going to be very easy it's going to be very comfortable it's going to be very um, uh, mess proof but you're going to look more upscale than if you're you're wearing your old event t-shirts from 10 years ago okay now for the bottoms this is super easy we have a, a pair of joggers these are the avia women's micro fleece joggers but you can do any joggers you can do a lighter weight jogger um whatever jogger you've got you know you want but you want like a nicer jogger that doesn't look beat up and by nicer i just mean it's in good shape it's in good quality um and this is a black one so it's going to go with all the tops and the jacket very very well for the shorts i chose these um pull-on shorts from time and true um because they're really really comfortable and they're a pull-on style and you're not like oh why did i why did i why am i wearing something so restrictive like this is just as easy to get down on the floor and do whatever you want to do with as 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 it is to you know wear whatever pajama bottoms or something they're they're super comfortable and and i like them in this neutral because i think it's going to go real it's going to give you a different option besides black and it's going to go with all the tops so that is the at home casual super like laid back cluster from walmart now we're going to look at, I believe this is the last cluster. Oh, I can't believe I'm getting to the end of these. These are so fun. Um, we are looking at like a resort cluster, like a boating cluster. Um, I, I've, I've had some requests for this. Like, what if you live a resorty lifestyle? What if you're boating and, and sunning and, and vacationing in warm spots all the time? If so, that's amazing. And I'm so, so happy for you because that sounds fabulous. So we're going to create a cluster that's going to work for a boating resort lifestyle. Okay, so first, I, I'm just going to have to show you this because it just, ugh, it's so ridiculously pretty. It is fancy, but it's so pretty. Many of these pieces are from Hallsbrook, um, which is a very classic website, but this is the Marizia Swami's Rash Guard in Dawn Shell Print. It is the prettiest rash guard. I feel like this is a top that can that can function as a swim top that can give you some sun protection, checks all of those boxes, and it's also really, really, really pretty. Um, a striped top from a uh, long sleeve striped, Marinier top, boating top, very, very classic and preppy element here from St. James. This is the Monkey Dem blue striped uh, cotton top. Love, love, love. And then um, I also have, this is from Sale to Sable. This is their blue gingham, if you want a little bit of a dressier option, blue gingham eyelet cowl neck top. So very pretty, great to wear out to dinner um, after a day of boating, like a very, very pretty and um, feminine option. Okay, 
For the bottoms, I have this pair. These are from Vineyard Vines, this pair of wide leg linen pants. Um, great pull-on style linen pant, very, very comfortable. As far as I'm concerned, this is a boating and resort lifestyle essential. Very easy, very breezy, very light, very comfortable. Still gives you the coverage in the legs. Um, and then a Jude Connolly, the Live White Skort. So this is like a pull-on skort for boating and for doing those athleisure activities. So you can wear that with a rash guard if you're on the boat, then you can change um, into the white linen pants afterwards and, and go out to dinner and you'll be all set. I also love this, this tote. This is the um, Demolier Mini Santorini Cobalt Blue Leather Raffia Tote. So beautiful. Picks up on the blues and the colors in this and the and the very seasidey um, uh, kind of aesthetic that we have going on here, and I love it. Love it. Also, I really like this Louisa Lady Jacket in white denim from from J. Crew as part of this cluster. I think it just works very very well with this. You want just like a nice lightweight jacket. Um, another accessory I would add here is this is a straw hat. This one is from Weekend Max Mar. It's a little bit more premium but I, I think that that is absolutely perfect. Now, what kind of shoes do you need? Of course, you're probably gonna need, you might want some kind of boat shoes or you can do like just a classic white canvas sneaker. Um, and then you're going to want like a, like a waterproof flip-flop or waterproof sandal, of course, for boating. So I'm gonna pop up some options of those that will round out this cluster, add some style, add some versatility. If you've got a little space on the boat or wherever you're at, you want a pair of espadrilles, to go with this, I feel like it's just a natural. I would absolutely 110% add these. Um, these are from Talbots, these iCat, Izzy iCat medallion espadrilles. I would absolutely 110% add those espadrilles to this cluster. Um, and I and then I would also, also from Talbots, I would add these Gola coaster sneakers. So I'd add the espadrilles, I'd add the sneakers. And then if you need, a, a like I said, a flat waterproof sandal, like a flip flop, um, style that would be awesome okay now we're going to talk about like just a, a summer cluster this is one i created and i've already shared it's from j crew but i just i have to share it because i love it so much so i'm going to share it again this is a great like fourth of july all summer long i want to elevate my summer wardrobe how do i update my wardrobe for summer what do i buy for summer this is everything you need in the first summer wardrobe kind of all in one so it starts with a wide leg sailor jean. You know, I'm loving this those this season. I just love them. These are the two bottoms for the cluster. So the wide leg sailor jean in white and then the pin tuck suit shorts in stretched linen in red. I love these shorts from J. Crew. It's really kind of hard to find a dressier short right now. And I think that's a beautiful, polished and elegant option for those of you who are comfortable with shorts. So you've got the wide leg pants and then you've got the red shorts. Now for the jacket, of course, you're gonna have the red li stretched linen blazer that goes with the shorts. So you can wear it as a suit and you've got that that polished look and you can wear them separately and have a more laid back look so I love that um, now for shirts we have the collection classic fit eyelet shirts a beautiful eyelet button down so it's an elevated white button down that I think is so polished and so pretty um, I also added this cropped v-neck sweater tank it's not it, it's not really that cropped it's just going to come to your waist very very pretty lacy kind of white tank I think that's a great addition um, to this cluster and it I think it's just going to be absolutely beautiful in this collection and then we have this it's a tile print blue stamp floral, blue stamp floral um, printed shirt. So you've got the long sleeve white shirt, the, the white knit tank, and then you've got the blue floral shirt. And I think that it's just such a, a, a fun and cute combination. The red, white, and blue, you've got the patriotic elements there. Um, I also would add, since we're adding dresses to these now, I would add this cotton wall button front cover up dress in blue stamp. Also, what I love about this dress is it's a very easy breezy lightweight cotton dress. It's a swing dress that I talked about. One of those styles that's very flattering on a lot of people, but it also buttons all the way up the front. So you can also use it as a layering piece. If you want to throw it on over the shorts and the tank, that would be super cute. You can just wear it a number of different ways. It gives you that versatility. Now for 
accessories for this collection. I think I've covered all my bases. We have the three tops, we have the two bottoms, we have the jacket and the dress. Um, I really like these Violetta made in Italy woven kitten heel sandals. Um, so these are like an off-white or white sandal. I think this would be so pretty with everything in this cluster and it's just the dressier option because whenever you're creating a cluster, try to think of versatility. So if this is going to be a cluster you're going to dress up or down a little, then you want a, an option that's a little more polished and one that's a little bit more casual. So the more casual option is the this knotted espadrille slide in metallic leather. I think it's very, very pretty, very polished, um, very fun. And it's a, it's an elevated take on a flip-flop without wearing a flip-flop, which is so basic and overdone right now. Um, and I just feel like, you know, there are other options. So let's explore some of those other options that are just as comfortable, just as versatile, but a lot cuter. So I hope that you enjoyed this. This is clusters for your life, clusters for your everyday actual life that you can wear and uh, you, you can buy these pieces, assemble them with things in your own wardrobe, replace some of the things that I showed you with things you already have, fill in the gaps, and then create these versatile mini wardrobes for yourself, for your lifestyle, for your actual life, for the parameters that you have, whether it's geographic or or um, workplace or um, lifestyle or body type. Just make them work for your, you know, tailor them to tweak and tweak them so that they work for you and um, really run with this concept. I can't wait to see what you guys come up with. I can't wait to hear your comments so definitely don't forget to comment if you have not signed up for my body type video series you you need to do that you need to do that you just go to netamanly.com slash body type sign up for that video series you will not regret it it is it is i i you know i've spent a lot of time putting it together and i think it's something you're going to get a lot out of um don't forget to like this video if you liked it subscribe if you haven't already just hit that little red button so we can hang out again and i will see you in the next video